Welcome back to my channel guys, Archie Masa Share. Today, we will study about the law of Moses and the law of Lord Christ Jesus, and which is the teaching of the Antichrist. But before we start, please subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell so that you will be notified for my next video. Yes, I'm coming soon. Lord God, Jesus Christ, bless us all. Today, we will study about which is the preaching and teaching of the Antichrist, Moses' law or Lord God Jesus Christ law. God gave Moses the Ten Commandments that according to Exodus 31 verse 18. That says, Then as the Lord finished speaking with Moses on Mount Sinai, He gave him the two stone tablets inscribed with the terms of the covenant written by the finger of God. Now question, when did Moses wrote about Lord God Jesus Christ? Because Lord God Jesus Christ claimed that Moses wrote about him. That according to John chapter 5 verse 46 that says, But if you had believed Moses, you would have believed me, because he wrote about me. So, Lord God Jesus Christ claimed that the Ten Commandments that Moses wrote is all about Him. Now, question. Did Moses wrote the Ten Commandments? Answer. Yes. And this is how it happened. In Exodus chapter 32 verse 19 that says, When they came near the camp, Moses saw the calf and the dancing. In terrible anger, he threw the stone tablets to the ground, smashing them at the foot of the mountain. Exodus chapter 34 verse 1 that says, The Lord told Moses, Prepare two stone tablets like the first one. I will write on them the same words that were on the tablet you smashed. Deuteronomy chapter 10 verse 2 to 3 that says, and I will write on the tablets the same words that were on the one you smashed. Then place the tablets in the secret chest, the Ark of the Covenant. So I made a chest of acacia wood and cut two stone tablets like the first two. And I took the tablets up the mountain. In Exodus chapter 34 verse 27 that says, and the Lord said to Moses, Write down all this instruction, for they represent the terms of the covenant with you and with Israel. Verse 28 that says, Moses was up on the mountain with the Lord forty days and forty nights. In all that time, he neither ate nor drank. At the time, he write the terms of the covenant, the Ten Commandments, on the stone tablets. According to the scripture, Moses wrote the Ten Commandments, and Lord God Jesus Christ claimed that Moses wrote about him. So the Ten Commandments Moses wrote is all about Lord God Jesus Christ. So the law or the Ten Commandments is all about Lord God Jesus Christ. Question, is the law or the Ten Commandments take effect on the day Moses wrote the Ten Commandments or the law? Answer. In Galatians chapter 3 verse 19 that says, Until the seed to whom the promise referred had come, the law was put into effect. Notice the word seed in this verse. The word seed is referred to the Lord God Jesus Christ. So the law take effect on the day Lord God Jesus Christ died for a sin and ascend into heaven. So the law or the Ten Commandments did not take effect on the day Moses wrote the Ten Commandments or the law. So the law is not about God the Father, it is about Lord God Jesus Christ. Right. So the law or the Ten Commandments is temporarily about God the Father. Until to whom the promised referred had come, the law was put into effect. This verse says, Until the seed to whom the promised referred had come, the law was put into effect. Since Lord God Jesus Christ had already come, the law was put into effect. But on Moses' days, 
the law was not put into effect yet because the Lord God Jesus Christ had not yet come. So Moses' law is temporarily in effect that according to Colossians chapter 2 verse 16 to 17 that says, Therefore, do not let anyone judge you by what you ate or drink, or with regard to a religious festival, a new moon celebration, or a Sabbath day. 17. These are a shadow of the things that were to come. The reality, however, is found in the Lord God Jesus Christ. Now, notice the word shadow. The word shadow show us that Moses' law is temporary and Lord God Jesus Christ's law is the reality. Now question, what is the difference between law of Moses and law of Lord Christ Jesus? Answer, law of Moses is all about the preaching and teaching to worship God the Father alone and only. And the law of Lord Christ Jesus is the teaching and preaching to worship the Lord God Jesus Christ alone and only. Remember Galatians chapter 3 verse 19 that says, Until the seed to whom the promise referred had come, the law was put into effect. Now question, which is the teaching and preaching of the Antichrist, Moses' law or the law of Lord Christ Jesus? Answer, the teaching of Moses' law is to worship God the Father alone and only, and it is the shadow of the things to come. And Lord God, Jesus Christ's law is the reality. So the teaching and preaching of the Antichrist is Moses' law, which teach us to worship God the Father alone and only, which is the shadow of the things to come. On my next blog, we will study about why Lord God Jesus Christ teach us to pray to God the Father in Matthew chapter 6 verse 9 to 13. Read your Bible every day and pray every day. Lord God Jesus Christ bless us all and please subscribe to my channel Archimasa Share and please like and share. Thank you for watching.